All right, let's move on now and talk about that annual SIAM convention that's held in the capital. Lots to worry about for the industry because, of course, things haven't quite gone its way for some time now. Now, it isn't just about dwindling sales. It's also about making sure that the market progresses overall and certain trends, etc., start to emerge too. Where does the industry stand on all of this and where is it going? Ronak Shah was at the convention to find out. It's been a long and slow three years for the auto sector, but halfway through the current final, the industry has shown positive growth. I won't say it's fantastic and there are people desperate to buy vehicles. I mean, we do have a lot of selling. But you see a significant improvement in heavy commercial vehicles. You see some improvement in cars. Still a lot of new launches are going in, exciting the market. So I think overall it's good. I'm a little concerned on the two-wheelers, but I think two-wheelers will also come out of it and start growing. The sales of passenger vehicles grew by 7.46% in April to July 2015 over the same period last year. The two-wheeler industry, though, has seen only marginal growth at 0.52%. The recent reduction in the fuel prices and a slight decline in interest rates has also helped. The Society of Indian Automobile Manufacturers, or SIAM's annual convention, hailed Prime Minister Modi's Make in India effort, but also expressed concern over the lack of movement on the road and transport bill, and remains hopeful on GST finally going through. As far as I look at the market, you know, the, the total market is growing a little bit, but uh, uh, look at that, you know, prayer where big difference happened because uh, the player who are bringing the new product, uh, they will be uh, successful, but uh, not the end the new product, they are losing. That is the real situation also. Overall, market itself, not so bad, but not so good. It's been a mixed, uh, mixed uh, year so far. Uh, some segments have done well, some companies have done well. Uh, the, the passenger vehicle segment is about, about okay, but the small commercial vehicle segment has uh, really been growing now for almost three years. What's done very well is the heavy commercial vehicle, uh, which for the last 12 months has had consistent growth of 20% plus. So I think uh, a little bit more uh, sort of uniform growth is needed, which I hope to see in the next few months. And the concerns are not just specific to certain vehicle segments, but also by geography. If you see from the urban and semi-urban, uh, because these are the markets which are consuming more of scooters compared to the rural India, so this uh, this uh, was positively. Well, I would not say it was very promising as far as the total volumes are concerned, but yet at the same time, uh, it was uh, you know positive enough to give us the incremental volume. And in the rural, it was uh, subdued uh, primarily because of the uh, motorcycle market uh, could not show any sign of improvement post November. 2014. The industry is expected to show an overall growth of 7% this year, which is in line with its growth forecast. Manufacturers are now looking ahead to the upcoming festive season, which is expected to boost sales. Some new launches are also going to be key for players like Renault, TVS, Toyota and Ford, who have missed out so far this year.